Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Connect 36 Presents the Bearded Kings. Of course, over in this corner, you got King Bear in the building. Comedian CJ Travis, what's going on? Heavy duty cutie, big tone. Big sleep. These are the vibes for today. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> the word footed bay. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> it's valid all the way until we get up to uh, Would You Rather. <laughs> That's what it's, it's, even, it's double valid for, for that. Team protect booty. Team protect the booty. <laughs> oh, man. So how's everybody's uh, week been this week? Nah, it's pretty good. It's been, it's I'm been just great. glad the weather's getting better here in Atlanta, Facts. man. Besides a little rain a couple days, but, man, it's been breezy, sunny, you know, less pollen. Yeah. Anytime there's like less that. pollen. Yeah, as long as it's like that, yeah. we good. Yeah. All right, here come that that uh, that Ike Turner meme. <laughs> they can be turned around looking at you. Yeah. You said what? <laughs> Remember, right. soon, as, soon, as you, soon as you think you're out the woods, they right. come come right back. Remember yeah. uh, Malcolm's rule: no shorts until seven consistent days or seventy warm degrees of more. Seventy seven. degrees. Yeah, like and Georgia ain't, ain't the type of mother bipolar motherfucker go eleven days and spin the black on your ass. Hey, at that point, <laughs> black at that point, that motherfucker will spin the black on your ass eleven days. <laughs> Bitch, what you say? Hey, at, at that, that point, point, I just <laughs> rock it. The commitment's been made. <laughs> yeah, I, I just rock it. So uh, we got some interesting things to talk about uh, this week. So uh, without further ado, you guys ready? Yep. Let's, let's rock. It. All right, let's get Woo! to it. thing i want to ask you guys um pause is it no no you know you'll sleep you'll sleep, you'll sleep. You'll last the shirt again nah <laughs> <laughs> oh i just realized you sir all right that's dope yeah yeah because it's gonna be that type of show okay it, it, it's this type of show this week y'all oh, oh. Week. That's right. Jesus Christ. I got yeah, a feeling, we about bro. To get on I got a feeling. We about to get on. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Cliff, hold my hands, bro. Hold All right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold Hell no, <laughs> man. This is sensitive. Let's go. <laughs> Shit, let's go. Whoa, oh, we haven't even got oh, to the dude. topic yet. It's good, good to be back. Yes, sir. <laughs> we missed you, man. We missed you. Oh, man. Yeah, dying, dirty laundry waiting for you, bro. Okay. <laughs> Hey, we do that too. <laughs> Is it acceptable to identify as something you're not? Absolutely. What, 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 what do we identify? If, hey, if I if I murder somebody and go to prison, you know where it's about right to go. Now, yes. If I murder somebody and I have to go to prison, he's I'm not talking about this. Yes. He's talking about that other <laughs> shit. I don't know where I'm he's going. going. That's what I was saying. So you gotta watch. So, you gotta, you so, gotta ask the questions. As, as, a, as uh -huh. a blanket statement. As of now, I want to yes. identify as I'm Until rich. you add more content. Yeah. <laughs> okay, fair I want to identify as I'm rich. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> I want to identify as somebody with ex superb credit. Absolutely. Yeah. He identify oh. as handsome. Oh, okay. I, I'm fucking handsome. Fuck no. you. <laughs> <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Let's go, nigga. <laughs> Start with it already. <clears throat> no. All right. So basically, what I'm getting at is um you know all these cases that are popping up where um and it seems to be more and more and more uh coming up these days where um men are taking advantage of the the pendulum swing that society has done whereas you know and the most prevalent thing is women's athletics Oh, all right. So, oh, I you see, that, that, that's where I'm going with like, it. That's, a, that's so, some bullshit. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, that's not okay. So, basically, you know, it, it's been quite a few cases, quite a few. A lot. Where um, all of a sudden, because, because society has swung so far that it's like, not only do you have to accept what somebody identifies as, but if you speak out against it, now you run the risk. Of, of being persecuted. Let me tell you what happens. That goddamn Kardashian. 
<laughs> is that what started this shit? And when that nigga won Woman of the Year? Yeah. It was downhill. You know what? That's a good point. It was the downhill from there. Team against anti natural all day. Come on. Uh, you gonna be women women of the year, nigga? <laughs> you just got to the show. You just got here. And you, and you only won it. That right, too. Uh, right. That was, of the whole that was, year? That was the sh- that was disrespectful. That was super disrespectful. Word. That was disrespectful. So from that point on, it was like, yeah, this shit about this shit going down. Like, <laughs> hey, we anti natural. When he when when he won, the pilot the pilot literally put on his uh, put on his parachute and jumped off. The <laughs> That's exactly what happened. Literally put on the parachute and jumped off the plane. He was like, hey, I hope nigga, hope y'all are good. Right. Well, I'm <laughs> J- nigga put Jesus got out the plane. car. <laughs> Jesus is like, you drive your own car, right. mate. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not no, taking, I'm not the, taking wheel. that wheel. Uh-uh. Yeah, the this only is reason over. why he he got that that award is because he was famous, or oh, he is famous. Nah. You know what yeah, I mean, well, I mean, because his name recognition and the life of the Kardashians. I, I if it was anyone else, if it, if it was Cliff, why would it? <laughs> I'm just, it's just Damn, so if it Yo, was no. Cliff, if it was you, hey. or I should say Moesha. No, if it was her, it was you. Hey, no said, love. Said, clip it and nobody paused it. <laughs> Pause. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It would never thank be you. I was seeing how far this rabbit hole no, go. No. <laughs> it would never like, be me. Where's it going there, Peter Rabbit? You, <laughs> you start off with the titties right now. You closer to it than I am, nigga. You already got the starter set. Well, by mice and natural. Here we no, go. No. Okay, that's even better. That's the reason why you should start off. You don't got to take the hormones or nothing. Oh, my you God. You just got to get a fucking <laughs> tummy tuck. I'm a cheap date. No, you're not a cheap date. <laughs> they take your ass to the buffet wherever the fuck you go. Exactly. <laughs> or you can eat for one price. No, no. no. Two hours later. <laughs> That's exactly what's going to The Asian niggas are like, get this nigga out of here. Get this hey. nigga out of here. Hey. Hey. I don't think you got that. What <laughs> 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 he was trying to tell you to shut the fuck up. Shit. <laughs> oh, That's what he was trying to tell you. He started that shit. Fuck it. <laughs> Boy, I threw that alley you. <laughs> nah, but seriously, you know, well, ridiculously on the serious side, though. Yeah. You know, because you, you know, one. One thing that I, I seen recently, the most recent thing that I seen was basically uh, in Canada. Canada has a very, very liberal, however, very strongly enforced uh, inclusion rule there. Whereas if somebody identifies as the opposite sex or anything, a, a moose, a Klondike bear or whatever they want to call themselves... Not only do you have to accept that, but you're not allowed to speak against it unless you face persecution. Wow. And yeah. one of the places in Africa has the exact opposite. <laughs> you come in there on bullshit. Yeah, if you claim it, you touch a dude on his penis, anything like that, you out of here. Either jail or you get killed. So I just read that shit like a week ago, two weeks ago. So on the opposite side, them wow. niggas ain't playing over. So they're trying to swing the, the pendulum right. back right. towards right. reason. <laughs> well, I, I joke, if your risk I go like this, it. nigga, it's going to be over. <laughs> I, joke, I, joke, I joked about it in the open, but there, there's really people here that are being sentenced to things or they're getting, they're getting caught doing things and they're identifying as the opposite sex. So there's dudes that's out here or, got, or people who were born a male. Let me watch myself. But dudes that are born a male that are identifying women getting caught in crimes and saying, hey, I'm a woman, so if I'm yep, found guilty I and too. I deserve, since I identify as a woman, I, I need to be locked up with women. And women in prison. Yep, I heard that too. Yeah, and that's true. there was that's a smart. case where smart, there was a, there no, was a uh, they, that, actually, that actually happened. They put a naturally born male mm-hmm. in, a, in, a, in a woman's penitentiary and the women were coming up pregnant. I was about, I was to, about to say, everybody yeah. got pregnant. He did. He got a, he got a couple of pregnant. Come, there was women coming up pregnant. Mm-hmm. It's a slippery slope. It's a very slippery slope. But see, that's the thing. They were huh? all happy in that situation. <laughs> they was happy to get some dick. He was happy to get some coochie. That shit was like a win Right. <laughs> no need for conjugal visits because right. it's a conjugal stay. <laughs> you just in there already. So they go to loopholes. Instead of getting become Muslim, <laughs> embrace being a woman. Word. <laughs> I get how much? Double life? I'm a woman. I want to do my double 77 life. 77 versions? Nigga, I got 77 years. I'm right. good. good. <laughs> I'm good. Right. That's just going to get worse because, you know, if, if, I, if I come in and go to Cliff's job and say, hey, I identify <laughs> as someone with good credit, with good credit, and I'm rich. 
Right. And you're going to deny me because, you know, the number says something else. I'm like, no, nah, man. Well, it's going to get so bad where you don't even look at the numbers. Right. Just because yeah. you, you said it. <laughs> you won't be able to. I'm, I'm white. I'm half Jewish. Yeah, no contestation. Yeah. I, I can't. I can't contest it. Yeah, that, that's, that's we had to have a last silly, week. Man. We had to have a last week. Lady, lady try to put a check in, and we put a hold on check. She has no account with us. It's a lot of money, mm -hmm. and she she wants to get it cleared immediately. No, ma'am, you don't have an account. We have to either open an account and put it in, or you know, Take go to check your cash place. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's Bank of Iberia, oh, so she's not going over there. It's international. Yeah, it's I bank whatever. One of them oh, Iberia. Iberia. Uh, I was like, uh, yeah, I, uh, Bank uh, of Iberia. Yeah, yeah. So she goes. She tells the banker. That she's going through a situation where she doesn't have a home a home to stay at right now. She's in between places. So Find when he church. goes and asks the, the, the teller, how long is the hole going to be? She says seven days, which is normal. That's that's not yeah. bad. Right? It's normal hole. Longer. It could right. be ten. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. seven. Yep. She comes back and says it's discrimination because she's homeless. And we have to escalate that because she said it. Yep. And now it's, it's an issue. In case there's now any it's getting looked at by DMs and all kinds of stuff. Just because she said she was in between. She feels like we discriminate because she's homeless. Why didn't y'all tell her to just identify as a home full person? <laughs> <laughs> you mean homeowner? Home, homeowner? <laughs> home full. <laughs> but I'm just saying. It, it sounds it's like she's like, she she identifying straight. as that Nigerian. Sounds just like that, she's it, identifying as that Nigerian prince that's trying to get <laughs> that. She's trying she try to get With that. With a lottery ticket, right? Right. Yeah. Yeah. Lottery yeah. wins. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah so. And that example that, that I saw, I saw two crazy examples. Um, and I think I told you guys about it. Uh, the uh, There was a weightlifter in Canada. Uh, basically, I think he was either Olympic bodybuilder or he was right below uh, qualifying for Olympics. Straight up dude. Straight up beard. You know, no, no thing about it. But because of Canada's laws, my man goes in to uh, all women's competition and says... I identify as a woman. With the beard. Full beard, everything. My man just woke Yo, I identify as a woman today. I'm here to compete. Some bitch made shit. My man broke the women's records by like 100K on everything he did, wow. dude. Some bitch ass shit. But, but wait, there's more. Uh, maybe he so, was making a point, though. Yeah, yeah. He was doing it to kind of make a point. Was it? Okay. Yeah. Oh, but okay. see, because he said that and because of how Canada's rules are set up, they couldn't contest it. They were just like, well, he says he identifies. But now it's in the record books, and you made it so fucking astronomically Ridiculous. high that that shit will never be reasonable for any real woman to fucking touch. But here's the twist. Here's the twist. The records that he broke were set like six years ago by a trans woman or a trans man. What, what yeah. the fuck? I don't know. Trans what trans woman. Woman. It used to be a dude. Yeah. He, he transferred to so a he, woman, and he broke the records. And the records that he broke was already 60 uh, kilograms more than any woman before. Wow. Wow. So, so did, this is where it gets down. funky. So that motherfucker was there and had the nerve to catch an attitude that this man came in and broke all his <laughs> records. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Cause now he, he completed hey. the process now. So niggas like, hold hey. on. Hey. This nigga still got his nigga man. <laughs> That was like Kareem and LeBron when, when, right. when Kareem, Kareem did not like that shit. LeBron, he did not like that. You saw nigga's face. <laughs> that was the longest handshake ever. Nigga handshake that nigga from across the room. Like, yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> Kareem was like, here, nigga, take this ball. So I can go. <laughs> you know why they keep calling me. Here, take this ball. You couldn't wait 10 more years when I was out of here, though? Right. <laughs> yeah, really. Yo. Yeah, that's true. Kareem so, didn't want that shit. They interviewed the uh, woman thing or whatever it is. Woman thing. That, uh. <laughs> So insensitive. <laughs> He's trying to get canceled, bro. He's trying to get canceled. They right. interviewed the women thing. Yo, I'm, I'm, what? <laughs> At least I'm acknowledging it's a women thing. <laughs> a woman come on, person. Come on down the rabbit hole, fellas. Come on. No, let's, no. Come on with me. Let's no. go. No, sir. We'll look at you from the hole down here. Like, I'm a flood. <laughs> It's water season. Hey, is that you right there, man? Right. Hey, I'm not. I'm, I'm not with it. No sir. I'm not with it. I'm not with it. Hold on. Hold on. So they asked him, and then this one says, "Well, obviously he did it with malicious intent." Yeah. He was like, yeah. "It's he did this 
because basically he was an asshole. And this isn't fair to us women. Us. Us. This is what the man said in the article. He he did that against us women. He said, now my situation is different because I uh, I trained <laughs> I I I I Transgender. jumped over whatever I committed the fuck. to I, it. I leaped the broom. Like what the fuck is it when you do it? Like they form. Yeah, he she, went- he yeah, she. The, he he auto bodied the over. Yeah. This motherfucker went from. He went from the Camaro to Bumblebee. Word. <laughs> he, he went from Android to iPhone. My man. He auto bodied over. Damn. Hey, hey, yeah. I want no part of that. <laughs> <laughs> my, my, my man went from. <laughs> From the gun to Megatron, you know. Yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> so he, he he did the thing over, but he did it 20 years ago, and he did all the steps, and he's he's diligently taking all his medications, and so he is a woman, but he was born a man. I'm did sure he cut his pee off? He's a say he went he, through all the steps. He said he went through all the oh, steps. Wow, it's still so women that looking at him like nigga. Right. Yeah. Nigga, yeah. Shut up. Yeah. <laughs> she was still born with the, the denser bone structure, the, the denser muscles, the, the faster quick touch, the body that naturally spells. gives testosterone. Even though you're taking Estrogen. testosterone it's, suppressants, it's still there. It's still there. But which allowed you to step in in like with minimum training because the records had stood for 10, 15 years. You come in on your first competition and, break it. and you smash the girls' records by 60k, bruh. No, nah. that that's that's you working hard. That's not natural born <laughs> advantage that I you agree. had. I agree. So they were like, yeah, but you still was a man. And then he goes after he said all that and talked about this other dude who did it. He was like, uh, yeah, I could see how it's not. It's not completely fair, but it's those are the rules. But it was the rules that allowed that dude to come and beat you too. So yep. what is you mad about? Step up your game, sister. Right, sister boy. So or whatever. That's what I thought was absolutely hilarious. Because my man was my man <laughs> my man was genuinely upset. He was he upset <laughs> that this dude came in and broke his records that represent the women. Cause he knew he once he beat that record, he was like, "Yo, I'm going to my my deathbed with these records. Ain't no woman ever going to be born right. unless her name no is woman. motherfucking Wonder Woman. Right. Yeah. <laughs> going to break my records." So he took she the hard. trophies home and put that shit on his mantle. You damn right. And like, went to yeah. sleep happy as he should. Night. Yep. And went and went to went to the, the Olympics and represented his country. <laughs> That's right. I'm, I'm assuming it was like a cash prize or something. I, it, probably. Yeah, you know I mean, probably like, sponsorship like. You know, tie pounds and shit. So, yeah, yeah I, that'd be hilarious. Nigga, nigga tampon of the waist training <laughs> shit. He, all the female <laughs> shit. He got a sponsor. He got a lifetime, <laughs> lifetime supply of space. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> he's a spoke. He's a spokeswoman. Right. For, for menopause and all that other shit. <laughs> so my man, they, they don't show me the way. So, <clears throat> gentlemen, outside of my my regular toxic masculinity self and. You know, my testosterone riven rants. I am now going to become the greatest woman athlete that has ever lived. I'm about to set all their records off. <laughs> I'm going for it all. Anything except running. Like, you know, you say anything except running. I, they can have that shit. Like, who the fuck want to run anyway? Damn that. So, yeah. So, women records, uh, watch out. Because, uh, Malkima is coming, dog. Not Malkima. Malkima is coming. And Something more like a Moesha. Now nah, you ain't said that's yeah. Moesha, man. What are you talking about? Oh, but he wasn't paying attention. I heard it. I, <laughs> I ignored it. Go ahead. Malkima. You hear Fat Low over here? Right. <laughs> hey, uh, I know you ain't laughing. <laughs> Two ton titties over here. Whatever. <laughs> that's going to help my cause to become the greatest woman <laughs> athlete ever. <laughs> Oh my God! The, but just just on topic, and we could probably move on after this. But a couple years ago, there was a um, there was the same thing. A man had that had trans transitioned into a woman in order transpired, to transacted, 
<laughs> in, order, in order to compete in a in a woman's swim competition. Right, right. And yeah. he, he, he won the match. He, he won the match and then everybody was up in arms. But after that, like, and this is where the story kind of tailed off. Turns out dude was actually ass. Like he was he was getting blown out for the rest of the season swimming with the women. Really? I think that was on purpose, yeah. though. I think he was like, yo, let me just calm down a little bit so that, mm-hmm. you know, he, he see, look, I'm not, I'm not all that great. They're trying to threaten my life, took my kids away and shit. Was that the same yeah, case when the little white girl was losing her mind? More than likely, yeah. Yeah. yeah more I saw likely, that. Yeah. yeah, it was some girl who she had been swimming since she was three, little, little mm-hmm. Molly. Swimming Man, like, since how, she how was, was three, this? working hard. She had just clipped the record by like six tenths of a second. You know, she was yeah. all happy. <clears throat> this motherfucker get in the pool on the second day swimming. Yeah. <laughs> well, no, he was, well, and that was no, no, he, he was on the men's team at first. He was on the men's team. But he was ass on the men's team. He was ass on the men's team. Wow. He was ass on the men's team. Think it's time to take my talents to South Bitches. South Bitches. I'm going to go over here with these women's out. South Bitches. They were like, they were like, hey, Steve. It, the dude was like, hey, Steve, practice is over. He was like, nah, practice about to start. Right. <laughs> about I'm about, about to start. stretch with these women folks over here. <laughs> I, got, I, got a, I, got, I got a stretch because my practice is about to start. Hell. So yeah, I, he, I'm assuming they, they he won. I'm assuming he won the qualifier. legally he, w- he would be able to go to the women's locker room then, huh? If he identifies that, as a that's, female. That's the, right. the crazy that's part. The slippery, that's the slippery that's slope. That's the crazy right. part. I want to use the women's This man was room. a real live Jawan and Mayor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. That movie was wild. He said, oh, no, no, yes, don't come so. up now on my expense. First of all, that's no longer oh, a movie. That is now a documentary. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Facts, facts, facts. It really facts, is. Facts. Based facts. on real life. <laughs> facts. Facts. Oh, that motherfucker was a trendsetter. <laughs> what was that in the 90s, right? Yep. Yeah, no, wow. early 2000s. It was early 2000s. 2000s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I was grown when that came out. That was it was, 2000s. Yeah, it, was, it was funny for its time. Jawana. It was stupid. It was stupid <laughs> funny though. I like. I liked it, man. Yeah, yeah, I, I laughed at it. But um, you ain't laughing no more. Two thousand two. Yeah. Two thousand two. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I knew I was growing when that 22, came out. Twenty two. Twenty one years ago. Yeah. I think. But um, <laughs> filet meek y'all. <laughs> no, I still remember that shit. But um, that shit was a Simpson episode. But like you're saying, the slippery slope. <laughs> um, there was a a case where um, this woman. Mm-hmm tried to sue a restaurant and she got countersued. And what happened was um, her and her family were sitting in a booth at a restaurant and um, her daughter, six years old, had to use the bathroom Mm -hmm. and they were sitting close to the bathroom. So the mom said, all right, go ahead and go in there and go to the bathroom. Her daughter goes in the bathroom. While her daughter's in there, some grown ass man Comes out. goes into the same bathroom. Oh shit. So she's like, What the hell? She's like, Did he just go in there? So she gets up and goes in the bathroom because she just saw this man go in there. Right. And and she she alleges that when she got in the bathroom, the man was at the stall where her daughter was. But then when he heard the door, he had turned around real quick and started walking. So when she opened the door, she seen him turn and start walking away. Yeah. So like he could have potentially either tried to get in the stall or he could have been peeking in the stall of the damn thing. Yeah. Six year old girl in there. So the lady goes fucking ballistic. I would too. She goes ballistic. Yeah. So she gets the manager. She's like, how dare you allow this to happen? That's my daughter that's in there. Blah, 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 blah. She sets up to uh, sue the, the restaurant for for that. Now, bit of a stretch, but you can understand it on an emotional right. side. It's like, the restaurant can't control somebody from going in and out of battery. They don't have security posted right. outside the door. Right. They have a sign, woman, men. Right. The restaurant turned around and filed the lawsuit with the dude who walked in because the dude identified as a woman and she was the one who was being a problem. The mother. And they won? The article didn't say whether or not she won or not. But just the fact that they had the <laughs> unmitigated wow. goal well, he had, he had to, to what, file what, a counter suit. Let me tell you something. He would have to what, take what an ass whooping. What state, what, what <laughs> you, state you, was this? Do you, know, uh, do you know what state? No. No. Because I don't, it was down I don't, south? 
the the restaurant and the the person who identifies is not going to lose. But if it's if they in California, a good chance to win. Or New, oh. or New York. Yeah. New York. Yeah. Yeah. See, that, I'm, I'm convinced it wasn't down states. south. Yeah. Because down true. south, somebody would have got shot, and it would have been a totally different for. case. You yeah. It would have been a different yeah. case. If you yeah. if. Jackson, I thought it's going there. And I'm, 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 I'm <laughs> fucking that nigga up. I'm not saying I'm threshold. Not, I'm right. not saying what you're doing. Right. I'm coming in. I'm coming in, locking wow. the door. So what's gonna happen is <laughs> you about to bleed from every fucking hole you got right now. Now me and my daughter right, jumping right. you. Right. <laughs> you about to ask, identify as a punching bag. Yeah. <laughs> 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 fucking you up. They mess with my daughter. Yeah. Hell so no. yeah, this it's it's getting ridiculous, and I mean it doesn't even have to have the whole sexual thing um one other case that i know of which i thought was absolutely ridiculous there was a kid who was competing at like a like a video game tournament like to play like Like, smash brothers or some shit and he's at the tournament right so he's going he's he's basically worked all summer and his parents gave him an allowance and he's a young guy maybe 10 11 years old little white kid and um, he he busted his behind to, to earn the money to be able to go in and compete in this tournament. Sure. So he's doing actually good. So now he's up to the quarterfinals. He's won away. Wow. Um, yeah, so he, he's there, excited, there, right there. You know what I mean? Nervous, right. excited, and all that. Right. So the judge comes up to him, and the judge says, okay, you know, so we got to announce you and, and say what you did. Um, what are your pronouns? So the little boy goes, um, like he he's completely puzzled. Like this is not a question that anybody in normal rational society should be asked. So he goes, um, uh, I I guess uh, uh, he uh, he him and uh, uh, how uh, uh, and he does that a couple times before he remembers the the. Thank the you. third one, his. Oh, yeah. So he was like, he, him, uh, 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 and he's doing that. Then he goes, uh, oh, his. <laughs> yeah, his. So the kid even explained when he did it that way, it was because it was more of him being so nervous that he chuckled because he couldn't remember the final pronoun. All right. The judge goes, well, you know what? I identify as they and them. So you really didn't have to be an asshole about it. And that judge had that little 10 year old boy removed from the damn tournament. Are you serious? Because he was, he was violating their inclusion policy by not being sensitive to other people's he's pronoun ten, choices. 10 fucking years 10 old. 10 years old, dog. You guys need to be accountable to a society thing, yeah. type norm. And a grown ass person. That's holding them accountable to that boot. And then cursed him too. Told me he didn't have to be an asshole. I would have sued him. Oh. Sued and this him kid worked the whole the summer to, to pay for the trip to go. You know what I'm saying? And just like that. I'm sorry. I didn't even get to compete in the in a get, get me Cochran. Bring him from the damn <laughs> from, from the ground. Let's go. Cochran and Kardashian. That's oh, it. Shit. All for real. Get the whole family. Hell yeah. All of them. The but fit, yeah, though, man. The glove don't fit. But and, and that's the thing. Like, where does this stop? don't yeah as long, that, as, as, long as we the, keep letting niggas just get away with it's never gonna stop it's a slippery 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 slope that's mm-hmm. fucked up at this point slippery it slope. was a slippery slope we've all slid already nigga we on the bottom of, <laughs> we, we already at the bottom, bottom of the slope of the pool. We, yeah, this yeah, is yeah. this is we in double dead slime this is <laughs> we yeah it's, it's, it's way slippery all right looking up at the slope like yeah it, it was nice at the top. Right. You'll never, you'll never <laughs> not, get back to that. Not entirely sure how I got down here. <laughs> but things, things were so different when we were up there. <laughs> you know, I started talking to white folks back in the day. Yeah. I remember when it was okay just to be a man. <laughs> and be okay and with it. Too, right. Like back in the day. It wasn't okay to call you a nigga. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> and all we could do is. Those were the days. Those were the days. <laughs> Sound like Archie Bunker shit. Those were the yeah, days. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but I mean, you know, and it's like all I'm reminded by, by and it's kind of funny when I think about it like this, but. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to to us in our community, 
if if we all want to get in somewhere and we're piled in in front of a door or something like that and there's one security there and then the one person is able to slide through and security turns to get them now everybody rushes the door yep. yo that's what society is literally done house party yeah yeah, yeah some party. similar yeah, yeah, yeah. because you know you i i think that this whole when the whole black lives matter stuff started which i mean i'm not saying that it was bs and all like that what i'm saying is you know when we were trying to fight and say yo you know take us into consideration as well everybody else is like yeah us too get in there <laughs> and it's gotten completely stupid because now the whole movement of treating everybody equal has now turned into an inclusion movement which is not only treating everybody equal but now if you don't treat certain groups as equal they'll come for your ass and it's like, yo, like, what do you do about this? Nothing you can do. Don't get railroaded either way. Yeah. There's nothing you can do at this point. It's it, the, the numbers is against you. Even having an opinion, yeah. either way, yeah, you're going to get screwed. Is, the numbers is against you. You're never going to win. It's a, it's a losing battle. Nothing you're going to do. What you think over there, man? Um, <clears throat> the the analogy you made with the uh, with the open door makes it makes it makes so much sense because. You you will you you want to think that nobody's struggle is worse than anybody else's struggle, mm -hmm. but on on paper, we as blacks have been struggling, and our struggle has been like long and documented, mm -hmm. and it's just it's it's a bit unfair for society to now say, okay, we we hear what you're saying, you're right, you've been saying it this whole time, but we're taking what you're you're, we're, we're taking you into consideration, but now we got to take everybody else at the same time. We're, we're like, wait a minute, we still haven't finished all the shit that we got. Right. Y'all still, still ain't tightened up all the stuff that we got, but now the oppressed has to be wary of the uh, the rest of the oppressed. So it's, it's like I said, it's a, it's, a, it's slippery slope, but it's, it's as far as um, taking others uh, that are oppressed into consideration, you want to take everybody into, but it's just as, as one that's oppressed, it just kind of sucks. Knowing yeah. that you was impressed the whole time, and now you got to sit back and be like, okay, now we have to kind of include everybody else. Right. So, um, I'm, I'm, I'm more, I'm more open minded. I try to be weary of of everybody, but at the same time, you can't tell me that your struggle is worse than mine. You can't sit back and be like, okay, well, we've been going through this, you know, so now you have to be wary of what we've been going. Through. Mm. Cool. Mm. So, okay. That's, yeah, that's that's a good point. Man. My thing is this, your plumbing should have nothing to do with whether or not you can do a job. And it's that damn simple. Yeah, I agree. You know what I'm saying? Like, and, and also being paid equally. If you can do the same job, if you're a female in the corporate world, you should be paid the same as a male. That's my belief. You should. And, 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 a, but, it, a, but it doesn't happen. It's right. unfair. But, you know, in a, in a, wonderful kumbaya world i i can see that yeah. however that is its own slope because yes. how do you slope. tell how do you tell you know these multi-millionaire billionaires how much they can and can't uh pay somebody without them yelling communism or socialism it, it now you're in trouble <laughs> now you gotta if, back that up you have two resumes with the exact same experience mm -hmm. exact so one is a male was a female they look at it it's like this guy be worth eighty thousand, this young lady seventy. Well, why? I think Just that's. By sex. I, I think that's on the that's on the individual company. If they're if they're discriminating based on sex, then that's the individual company. You need to deal with that company individually. You can't just blanket everybody. Well, that, that, that's and what I mean. Make though. everybody it, fall it, in. Uh, that's what I mean, though. It's it's unfair for for the females. That's, that's and different. Than a sexual thing. But and 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 it's, it's still it's, it, it it is unfair. I see what you're saying, but here's the problem: years of affirmative action have literally swung that pendulum out of whack. And now, now the Me Too movement yeah. swung out exactly. The way too. So they so it's like I'm not saying they're good, but I'm saying they they got more opportunities now. They do, and see, yeah. and now, and that's where this this funky little sexual loophole comes into play. Because I was just making that exact example to my daughter, but with a different twist and perspective, mm -hmm. which is um, because she's all about inclusion. She she thinks it's fair and everything. So I, I, I presented her with this issue. Say you're up for a job 
and this guy's up for a job. Y'all have damn near the same resume. Y'all got the same work experience, everything. The company says we're looking to hire a junior female executive. So you both had the same <laughs> resume. Yeah, that's discrimination. But, but but it is discrimination, but it's discrimination with a positive spin because they're doing it because affirmative action says you have to have so many females on your, right. your top level. Or Latinos exactly. or blacks. Or right, whatever. right. So okay. they're trying to fill quotas. Right. But that's okay. because they fucked up in the past. Right, right. They fucked right. Yeah, at the beginning. Yeah. And, and that's what the I'm machine, saying. The machine so broke. Now, yeah, right. Exactly. So now they swung the pendulum trying to overcorrect for the situation. But now you literally worked in a new loophole. Because now yeah. if he says, we need a female executive in this position, you and this guy have the same resume. And he knows there's no way I'm going to get this job because they need a female for it. Now the next day he comes in wearing a dress and makeup and says he identifies as a woman. Ooh. What happens? Who gets the job? Ooh. That's a loophole right there. Exactly. Yeah. Ooh. And then, you know. Does <laughs> 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 he even have to get the dress on? Break, break out the swords and the Chinese stars. Let's get it. Yeah. Throw a sword on the floor and, like, whoever wins gets the job. There you go. <laughs> Fight to the death. Well, like Joker, man. Take the, take the uh, board, break it. There you go. <laughs> Fight to the we, death. So... And then her thing was, yeah, but dad, that's different because, you know, it depends on it, what his intent was. And I was like, you can't tell intent, intent you only can't tell matters, intent. only matters to the person that's serving. Intent is just like feelings. Right. That's all you it can't, is. You can't measure There's intent. no can't, way. Can't, there's no logic. way you can judge intent. Logic. You can't measure intent. Right. You can't. Because in this world, you can't, you can't argue with feelings. Yeah. The second anybody says, well, I feel you should, you can't argue with it. No. It's over with. All you can do is walk the fuck off. So, so she was arguing back and forth and she, she was getting the point, but she didn't want to concede it, the point. Yeah. So she was like, no, dad, it's just, it's intense. She's being a woman. Yeah. <laughs> so, you're right. You're right. And I don't want to say you're right, but yeah. you're right. Right. But, so, but. So how do, how do you like. I mean, you, you can't overcompensate, and that's the way the pendulum's going right now. Yeah. It's already swung, and now they're trying to correct it by overswinging that way, and they won't allow it to come back to the side of rationale, where it's like, look, like uh, like uh, Mr. Robinson said, boys be boys, mm -hmm. girls be girls, <laughs> and at the end of the day, you just do what you do. Like, I mean, if you want to be different, then go ahead and be different. But don't force everybody to accept your difference and then look at you like you're something you're not. Right. I, I look, don't. at the end of the day, I don't, and I said this in one or two shows in the past. I don't care if you cut everything off, you add to this, you, add, you have facial hair or whatever, right? You check your DNA, you draw blood, even after all the, exp the, the operations. It's still gonna come out in the smallest chromosome, either mm -hmm. you're male or female. I don't care what the fuck you you identify, your chromosomes are not gonna lie. Like the other you say, you still gonna need a prostate exam. Baby. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> pause. Pause. Yeah, they, pause. They get rid of that pause. motherfucker. Pause. You still gonna need one of them. <laughs> that shit's still there. <laughs> Oh, you know, so, oh, a whole new can of worms open. How do you <laughs> like? Which way do you? <laughs> you got. You just got a different uh, access. Which? Uh, <laughs> look, I, I, I'm a big believer, man. You know, whatever you want to do in private, that's your business, right? You want to dress up like a woman, that's your business. Do you, you think? You know what I mean? I don't care. But don't then identify as the opposite sex for a job an, or an advantage, an advantage. Right. type of advantage. Right. You know right. what I mean? That's, right. that's, that's, that's just wrong in my personal opinion. You know, that's just me. I, I'm both ends, women uh, as a male, vice versa. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, that that's that's logic. Yeah. That's rational. <laughs> that That's good thinking. But that defies emotion. It's all emotions <laughs> and feelings. Oh, since I was a kid, yep. I felt like I, I should have been a female. Well, you got a pee pee, bro. You gotta you Sometimes I mean? life is just about titties that are tough. That's <laughs> Your titties are still gonna sweat in the summertime. So you know what I mean. But, 
Swear to that shit right. remind me of that Ted shit. <laughs> Chicks with dicks. <laughs> There's no That's such so thing. <laughs> Chicks with dicks. <laughs> Only guys with dicks. <laughs> <laughs> that's that brother. That's what those oh, Ted, the, the teddy bear. Ted. Oh yeah, yeah. Teddy bear. That's one of the funniest shit. I swear, I love that the second one. That was the was second. Part- was it? I don't remember. It was, it was the one that was equally funny to me. But was it? Yeah. yeah. It was the first one. Right? I can't. Um, I think it was the one where he was working at the uh, something to do with a car dealership or something like yeah, that. Yeah, the first one. That's that the first one. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, Ted is hilarious. I swear that another was one. That's a classic. Yo, that they should be put in the Bible. Yeah. Like that shit should be biblical. <laughs> like I love that line, dog. It's a classic. That was the greatest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he said there's no such things as chick with dicks. <laughs> Only guys with tits. Oh. <laughs> it, it was in it was in two. It was, it was in two. two. Yeah, oh two. my god. I, oh yeah, yeah. Because one of them was looking at porn. Oh, that was great. All right. Uh, so basically, we ain't gonna come to no conclusion on ain't that. No conclusion. There, there isn't one. We're not gonna win. Whatever side you pick for opinion, someone's always gonna argue the other way. Well, I'm just not gonna ask people who they sleep with. I'm just like, look, can you do the job or not? That's right. what it should the rest be. Of, the rest don't matter. To me. And that's that's exactly what it should be, and not coming to the office. Well, I'm gay or I'm this or I'm that. I'm like, what the fuck? That got to do with anything? Okay, yeah. ask you. Does does gay money <laughs> does gay money have a different president on it? Like, <laughs> like, does it does it spend different? Right. Do I need to pay you out of a different drawer than I pay everybody else? Because if not, then leave that shit in your bedroom. Yeah. Like, why is you in the, in the job with that? Yep. A bunch of gay monopoly money I can pay you with. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Monopoly Damn. man with boobs. <laughs> He's like, yeah, you get this queer money. <laughs> with a short light. Which queer is good, I think. I, yeah, I heard cute, that somewhere. Don't go down the rabbit hole. It's the Q. I, I, I the think, Q. Yeah, I think they it's say the you can say queer. Queer. It's you the can't Q. say uh, fag or you can't say. Uh, <laughs> I'm saying what you can't say by saying. Uh, yep. Hey. I'm not with it. Hey, gotta say the F word, sir. It's just like it's just like that comedy joint where uh, they were sitting down with Chris Rock and, and they were asking about same nigga. Oh yeah, that's yeah. So that's what I'm doing. So I, I'm just because I'm asking a question, y'all. Yeah. I'm, you, I'm asking. You can, you, you can talk that's about you can talk, <laughs> you can joke uh, about blacks, but that that, 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 that F word. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I'm I'm so confused. There's there's so many. Like you can say trans, but you can't say tranny. Right. Mm. It's like a dirty word, right? It's like yeah. a it's derogatory. It's derogatory. <laughs> but I grew up thinking a tranny was a part of the car that like shifted I it was, gears. I thought it was part of the train. <laughs> what? I don't know. Oh, oh, that train. Yeah. 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 <laughs> mm. You know the, the, the train. The, the train. No, no, no. He's he's right. The, the train that you run. Oh, you, the train that the you train run. Ass. No, he's right. Oh, man. He's right. No, that's not. That's nah. a D train. That's nah. Paul's ass. Nah. Because we, you're still you're still talking about a trans trans person. No. Oh. No. 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 Oh. He's talking about he's talking about when you run the train. Yeah. I never called it that though. I never called a trainee. Tranny. You never called a trainee? Yeah, I'm, part of, I'm down with the trainee. You, 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 we never said that. We never said that. It was a train. Yeah, no he friends. He ran a train. Yeah. He, he, no he ran a train. He ran a train with right. both his hands. No. No, no. no, no, no. Now, that's the pause. That's the pause. That's the pause. That's the pause. Run the, run the tutor. I was at least giving you credit for the double, oh, but this no. thing. <laughs> no. No. Anyway. Oh yeah! Hey, Tiger. <laughs> anyway, like that chocolate. I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> that was again, nigga. God damn, you were just doubling down on this motherfucker. Stop, shit. Oh, oh my god. Oh, that's why they got you that chocolate dildo. Oh, oh. Hey, here you go. Oh, I left it. Oh my god. Next subject. That, that's why Sheriff don't come no more. Oh, hey, you got to be fast. You got to be faster on that bleep. Yeah, yeah. You got to be faster on that bleep. They got me laughing too. <laughs> Moving right along. Oh my god. Okay. 
on the other side of the universe, <laughs> fellas, yeah. swimming in the ocean, go or no go? Hard no go. <laughs> Hard no go. Swimming in the ocean. Swimming in the ocean. Hard. You mean no, like the real no. ocean, or no, it's is a it... fake ocean? The the fake fuck? Oh, no. <laughs> Where it comes from? <laughs> it's an alternative. You always have an analogy. You always have some sort of analogy oh, behind it. Like you know what I mean? It's like the real ocean. <laughs> yes, nigga. Bro, no, bro, when it comes to Malcolm, no, 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 no. Physically swimming in yes. the ocean. Yes. Going to the beach and getting into where the land ends, the yes. ocean. Yes. For me, yes. No, swimming in the ocean. Because you a fucking. <laughs> See, oh, there you go. See, my life is over. Then you go float. You good? Your life is over. You know what I mean? Your booty ass gonna go right to the top <laughs> and never float. Never sink. But no. <laughs> what about you? I can. I can. Not, I can, can you swim? swim? Can you I swim? Can swim? But I don't feel ocean swimming. Like I ain't feel like I could be good in that cold water with them fucking sharks. It's not really cold. Ain't you a cousin of a seal? Some shit. There it is, right there. there. I'm a cousin of what? With a seal? No, nigga, that's you. You're nah, closer bro. to a walrus than anybody else. Nah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you might put a picture side to side and see who looks more like it. Go ahead. Nigga, so you gonna go out here and swim in the ocean, the fake ocean? Which one? Real ocean or fake ocean? <laughs> when it comes to Malcolm and his questions, <laughs> you never know. No, man. You gotta be these. careful. Not these, man. No, All right. My, my topics aren't triggered, man. Okay. That's just the would you rather. That's would you rather. Right. Would you rather is the only thing triggered. I got, no, PTSD. I got PTSD because of this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I wear that badge with honor. <laughs> so what, what's the question behind it? Bacteria, no, no, no. There's, shark, there's, yeah, shark. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just <laughs> you know what I mean? bacteria. I don't know. know. It's like you, game game first. you got game <laughs> rainy yeah. egg. Like, what's the handicap for me to swim in this exactly. water? Exactly. What, what's gonna happen? <laughs> you just gotta like, oh, get, a, you gonna get bit no, by a shark. Right. Uh, I mean, yeah. Okay. Or that's, a, that's a potential. Or a stingray, a or potential. all right, you know, no big deal. <laughs> a horseshoe crab <laughs> upside down. No, I'm Fuck it. Yeah. no, I'm just saying, you know, you go to the beach with your family and your kids. Yes. You know, are you going swimming? And yes. what I'm talking about swimming, you going to like? I'm talking way. about not just wading into about where the water hits the bottom of your balls and be like, yo, that's good enough. I'm talking about actually getting in, going into the abyss. swimming, oh, yeah. going under, yeah. getting to the point where your feet aren't touching the ground and you can see wildlife underneath you and then you're going back. Sometimes nope. I go out snorkeling and shit like that. You know, I don't nope. mind doing that. Nah, I'm good. Nope. Is that motherfucking tide and that wave get your ass? You out there faster and further than nah. you thought you would. <laughs> it's it quick, too. <laughs> since, since, since Cliff don't watch our show afterwards, you got to tell him the, the, the whole uh, swimming incident in, uh, in Africa oh, or whatever. No, 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 no. That was in Japan. Japan. That was in Japan. That's why. Oh. <laughs> that he almost died and he thought I never shark. told you that no. story? No. All right. Uh, real short. Real yeah, short. Because I've said it before. Version. Yeah. So I got my scuba license in Japan. Okay. And a couple of my white buddies, my white marine buddies, <coughs> invited me out to another island uh, in Japan, EK Island, where they had like plenty of like coral and and stuff very, to, very pretty and shit yeah gorgeous to to look at mm-hmm. so right after i got my my uh scuba license um they had a japanese friend that had a boat so we all went out went on a boat and uh well we were just gonna go go uh scuba diving yeah. so go under take care of everything go underwater and it, it's beautiful under there right i mean it's very as to be as open it is, it is very claustrophobic. Like, because you you could see, but then you can't, can't see, see that absolutely. far. Right. So absolutely. it's like, uh, it's not, I, I it's don't know. Like you right. see shadows in the back. So yeah, you know. and, and, and everything is blue. Right. Yeah. So it's like... <laughs> the abyss. But, so we go, and we're looking at coral, a coral reef. And as I'm looking, there's a, a sea anemone. And I'm literally watching a clownfish going in and out of this this sea anemone. Mm-hmm. You know, so I'm like, oh, that's cool. Um, in our military days, we used to have this channel called the Armed Force Network or AFIS channel that just showed A-Fan. the same. Right, and one of their, their screen savers, it Sad. always showed a sea anemone with this clownfish coming right, out. Right, right. So when I'm seeing this, I'm like, oh, that's the same thing. Right, right, right. So I'm looking at that, right? And I'm like, yeah, this is cool. This is actually pretty cool. All of a sudden, and we're only about, I think we were about 20, between 20 and 23 feet down. That's pretty deep. Yeah, but it was, the water was so clear that, you know, we didn't need lights or anything. It was sunlight yeah. as we were looking. So I'm looking at this, and all of a sudden, 
all the light that I see goes away. It just gets dark. And I'm like, oh, it must be cloud, cloud overhead. But then it doesn't go away. And it doesn't turn. And I'm looking, and I can see the sun at this angle, but from over here, <laughs> it's no sun. So I'm like, oh, shit. Mm-hmm. So I'm sitting there like, oh, my God. And all, all the all the lessons that I learned in life are hitting me right then. Yep. Why is a black man scuba, right. scuba diving off the coast of Japan? Right. Like, that's not how we die. Right. Right? So I'm, I'm panicking and stuff. <laughs> So I'm going through everything and, you know, I'm going when they say, you know, sharks are extremely curious when they see bubbles or a lot of excitement because then you look like an injured animal. Right. And I'm already t- wrapped up like a fucking fucking uh, sushi roll and shit. <laughs> like, I'm right. giant, like I'm I'm dinner. Like in this, right. in this shark place. Like a, right. Right. A six foot four sushi roll. <laughs> right. This, thing is, oh, this is going to be a good one today, folks. <laughs> Already seasoned, <laughs> like I'm, I'm seasoned on the inside already. <laughs> Fucking Lowry. So, shit. so I'm like, oh shit, okay. So I gotta, I gotta slow down my bubbles. Um, so I reach for my regulator because I had a floating regulator. I grab it and it, I try to turn down the air pressure, and I'm panicking because I'm like fucking shaking while I'm doing it. I turn my air off. So now I'm underwater, and I'm like... 20-something feet. Yeah. Oh, shit. Underwater. Like, the world is closing in at this point. <laughs> I'm all these thoughts. Why am I doing this? I'm about to have my ass eaten from behind by a shark. It's like, yo, it's all going crazy. Oh, shit. He <laughs> <Like, laughs> said the ass <laughs> was eaten. He could have said I could have been bit hey, my leg. He, hey, he was straight for the hey, ass. Hey, <laughs> all that that you're thinking was in my head, too. All that. It was like, it's all fucked up. It's all over with. So, and and the bite never comes. So I'm like, what the fuck? So I, I finally get some air back in. I'm breathing, but bubbles are going crazy because I finally got it on. So I'm like, fuck it. If, if I'm going to go, I at least want to see what's going to happen. So I fan my hands and I, I slowly turn around. When I turn around, <coughs> it's this big, ugly, just huge, ugly fish. And I remember the colors was like brown, orange, with a little bit of silver and just big ugly fish with a big ass mouth and it looked like that motherfucker once I turned around it looked like he just mouthed the words like he said sup and then he turned and swam the fuck off <laughs> so I look at my two buddies and they're like I'm like you ain't, you ain't gotta say nothing to me I'm already on my way up I get up I'm in the boat I'm peeling shit off it's over with I, I'm done they come out they're laughing their ass off they were like man we didn't know what you were gonna do that was funny as hell they're like, what are you doing? Come on, we just basically started. I was like, I'm done. That's it's it. over. My fuck career. This, fuck this license. A career. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, I no never even, on this one. I've never donned another motherfucking wetsuit. <laughs> <laughs> I never read. I turned into tanks. <laughs> I sold my mask and my flippers. I was like, it's over. Y'all can keep this motherfucking license to yourself. Fuck that red, that red flag with the white stripe. Y'all kiss my ass. Never again. And it was you over. Know, I, I question the question for you guys. That was that was your story. That's when you knew that it was over, particularly for for you in that particular instance. Yeah. You guys ever have anything happen to y'all to where you realized that whatever it was you were doing it was time to tap out? It was over. Yeah. Ex wife. <laughs> hey, I got double down on that. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Imagine doing it to you. Like, fuck hey, this license. You, you're in a safe place. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> safe place. Safe place. Safe place. That's a good hey, I was in, yeah. I was in my, uh, yeah. I was in my early 30s, and a partner of mine who hit me up, we used to, like, every year we would play, like, <laughs> like I had a homie, homie of mine that we would play. This nigga play hard on the pause God damn. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> We play flag, we play flag football every year on on Camp Pendleton. They would have the turkey bowl, so we would go out there and play flag football every year. So Mel, this is in the military. Five, yeah. No, this is right after I got. Well, when I was in the military, we would play on a turkey bowl. So about right, five right. five six years after I got out, I hadn't not, hadn't touched the football and thrown the football. And a partner of mine hit me up. Well, my homie hit me up. He was like, "Hey, there's this flag football tournament going on at one of the local colleges." He was like, "Swing through." And my brain was just like, yeah, let's do that. So I went to went to the store, went and got me some cleats, started running, getting back in shape. And 
my uh, so we, we get out there we get out there to the field and now I'm, I think I'm like 32 33 and we're playing it we're playing against 17 18 19 20 year olds. Oh, so my mind is like I'm still, I'm still I'm still a man and and now mind you my brother can attest to this I've always been fast like I've always been able to run we're like not world class speed but yeah. we're in four four five you know four five forty feet Decent. and yeah. so my brain was telling me that I'm still 17, 18 years old and weigh 90 pounds and I can still run that four, five, 40. So we get out on the field, we start playing and there's this, couldn't have been no more than 19 year old kid. And he's just dusting all of our old ass, not all of our, all of my teammates at this point. He's just blowing past and I'm talking shit. I'm like, hey, somebody guard it. Like somebody like get y'all old asses up and guard it. So I think he scored like three times, three possessions, three times in a row. So I was like, you know what? I got it. I'm locking him down. So I go out there and I line up in front of this kid and I'm talking big shit on my way out there. I'm like, game over. You, you will, ne- they, they're not going to throw it to you. So you about to just relax. They snapped this ball and this kid ran past me so fast. I, my brain, <laughs> my brain, <laughs> brain and my legs, brain, they connect right hey, away. My brain immediately told my mouth to yell, I don't got him. <laughs> <laughs> and I was, help! <laughs> Somebody get this nigga. <laughs> I listened. And my mouth yelled out, I don't got him. <laughs> <laughs> He's loose again. <laughs> so needless to say, we got blown out by the kids. And at, at the end of that game, it was like, hey, we got another game for the losers bracket. I was like, yeah, no, I'm packing it up. I'm going, I'm taking these cleats. And all this gear that I purchased back to Dicks, and I don't don't ever call me again. So I get that. I'm <laughs> serious. So I go I, I go to the store. I go to sporting goods store. Now the cleats had grass and dirt all in them, and I'm like, yeah, I'm here to bring these back. And I'm like, sir, have you worn these? I was like, oh, absolutely. It was like we can't take these. I was like, oh no, you're gonna take them because I don't want any. I don't I don't even want to get the feeling that I'm gonna go back out there and be like, oh, I got some cleats in the closet and I'm ready to go. I was like, I don't even want my money back. Just take these. Shit. No. <laughs> sell them, sell them used. No, that's one of my possession. I was like, it's over. I don't want them in the house. Is it bad I, want, not, I, I told the homeboy, I was like, yeah, don't don't call me anymore. No <laughs> don't, don't I would have left those shoes on the field. That's I would have given it to the past kid. You gotta throw that shit on the fucking on the telephone pole, like, yeah. bro. Ah, fuck this shit. Uh, yeah, I was, find, find a kid that got some that's out there slipping in the grass. I'm like, hey man, I, I got like, some for was, you. That was it. They were some nice Nike cleats too. And I was like, nope. That was they were they were actually they were Jordan Eleven cleats. Oh, and I was wow. like, yeah, no, nah, you can you can have these back. I don't I don't want my money back. I don't, I just don't, I don't want to get the inkling and be like, oh yeah, I think I can still run. Nah, it's over. Man. So <laughs> that's rough. But um, just to reel it back in now. All right. So back on the ocean thing. Oh, shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah just oh. real quick. Sea world. Just real quick. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. I took my story and then yours piggyback perfect. So it wasn't on you. That was on me. But um, so Cliff, so. Outside of just the currents, that's the only thing that's bothering you. I just told you the sharks, all shit. That's not that's their living room. The fuck, I'm going fuck around. They live. Thank room you, <laughs> thank you, thank you. Man, I'm good. So ignorant. Man. I'm a firm believer. I'm, well, I'm a well, firm that's, believer. That's three ignorance, dog. Yeah. yeah. I'm a, I'm, Go at I'm it. A firm, I'm a firm believer in there not being a such thing as a shark attack. If your dumbass gets bit by a shark, that's self-defense, and you were you were invading his home. Use his you were a home invader. <laughs> you you are a home invader. He said we'd be ignorant. Go, go, go take your fucking light ass yeah. out there and go swim with them. Tell, tell, us, tell us was yeah yeah. Well, okay. I love to swim. Oh, that's fantastic. I love going in the ocean. Yeah, but that's why God created pools. Right. Nah. <laughs> like, there's plenty of places to swim. Can't stand pools. The chlor the Clorox people peeing on in a salt water pool. It's a shark oh, idea. Okay. I would like that. I would like that. That's salt water pool. You worry about people pee. Yeah. You know every animal on this planet pees, right? Piss, yeah. please. So you you swimming in that and but, spit and, the water and, out and and you really thinking that people ain't peeing in the ocean? Peeing the ocean? <laughs> yeah, but I'm far. Why you get salty? Nigga, 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 in the ocean, all types of crazy look, shit happening hey, in the ocean. Look at Tony O's face now. He's thinking about it like, wait. <laughs> <laughs> he's not thinking about. It. He still want to take it to so, the face. So what's the point you're trying to make about the ocean? No, I'm just trying to see what you guys is uh. I love the ocean. On. I love the ocean. So you go out far and, and you enjoy that. I will go as far as like. Maybe a little bit above my belly button. He just said, "Not nah, you got to go out, out." I'm talking about swimming. Talking about I've gone, I've gone where it's like up to here. 
You know what I mean? Now, if I'm scuba diving or or, sc- scro- or snorkeling, snorkeling. You know, no problem. I look Ladies around first. I'm like, all right. Well, I'm not. I'm not gonna go like 60 feet down. I'm gonna stay 10. It don't matter. You yes, still it there. Oh, okay. Ladies Them and gentlemen, you can see your little light skin fucking feet and go yum. Hey y'all, y'all. <laughs> <that's it>. Yum. <laughs> sharks, some sharks gonna be like, yo, y'all niggas want anything? I'm about to go grab something real quick. Hey. <laughs> yo, our Uber Eats just got here, dog. <laughs> right. <laughs> The, the jellyfish are going to paralyze you. The jellyfish are going to paralyze you. You're going to float your ass out into the ocean. <laughs> nah. Yo, I have this thing. Uh, a rule of my house is uh, if we go swimming, we never, ever, ever go past the white line. White folk line. Yeah. yeah. So we just established with his fairest skin, Antonio's going to be the official white line. <laughs> white line. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cause we're gonna be from the shore yelling. We, we God damn, it was good knowing you, nigga. <laughs> God damn. When I'm scuba hey. diving or snorkeling, I'm in the boat deep in the ocean with a group of people. I'm not doing that. Like, you know you where everybody else swim. Nobody in the ocean ever yelled shark. It's always somebody from the beach. <laughs> right. <Same. laughs> right. Just say it. <laughs> okay. Yo, I almost died uh, snorkeling. By a on our wedding. By a no, on our way. Oh, you double down? You win again? You start feeling <laughs> I'm it again? I was about to say, I thought you was never doing this shit again. What you start, you no. start feeling it this, again? No. <laughs> okay. Why them pleats? Okay. Why them pleats went okay. back to dicks? This, we <laughs> double <laughs> Okay. So, That's why they so, went back to dicks. So, like I said, I will never scuba dive again, but during our wedding, uh, when we went to uh, Bahamas, so I'm saying we like we went together as we got married, bro. You like our wedding, your wedding. I'm saying because you was there, yeah. so you were, you are a reference to right. it. Your wedding, I was invited to. Stop making it weird, man. No, man. Just get in the tub. Man. Stop, stop making no. it weird. Stop giving me eye contact. <laughs> you you're giving me eye contact. You see the sign? You see the sign? Eye, right there, eye contact, bro. Yeah, Come on, dog. Make bro. making me nervous. <laughs> stop making it weird. I'm a hand. <laughs> I never see that shit. Shit, hilarious. The sign says, get naked. Unless you're just visiting, don't make it weird. <laughs> That's right. I, I need that shit. You got that shit from that shit. That shit is dope, That's though. Funny. That's funny. Where you get that from? I, I don't even remember, man. That it might have been like Ross or, or Amazon or something. Spencer's would have some shit like that. Yeah. Yeah. That's so, <laughs> anyway, so mm-hmm. we were on one of the excursions mm-hmm. uh, on our wedding cruise. And um, we were going to ride the little submarines. You know, we had no idea what the, it was. The or, yellow ones? That yeah. You, you know, you put out, yeah, we didn't know what the hell that meant. It just oh, said, hey, that, ride man. the submarine. Oh, so I was like, that. cool, that sounds dope. Yeah. So me and the wife went on this excursion and should have known something was up because the captain was like, my man's safety brief was worse than <clears> any <throat> Marine Corps safety brief. He was like, yo, okay, so here's the safety brief. Um, We don't think there's any sharks out here. Nope. We ain't seen no sharks in about a month or so. So what? we should be good. We should be good. <laughs> and y'all still went? Dude, he said this while we were already on the boat and just like Mm-mm. bobbing back and forth, waiting to go into the water. Mm-mm. Put me back to so, up. No, yep, put me back it. in the boat. The, the, put me the, back right, in the boat. The right <laughs> must gave him like that look like, you know, we're going, right? It's our wedding day. Yeah. I mean, it was something she really wanted cool. to do and it was on. But that wasn't, that part was all right. But. What happened was, uh, they only had a certain amount of of uh, uh, submarines. Okay. I think this boat had maybe like eight submarines, and there was like seventeen or eighteen of us Damn. waiting to go. So they would do it in groups. So the first group would go, and while the first group went, you can either just sit on the boat or you can snorkel around, right? So, um, the wife really wanted to snorkel, so we got in water. I put on the flippers and. You know, snorkeling, I'm like, yo, it's safe So enough. you didn't get flashbacks when you put those flippers back on? Because we were in the ocean and right next to the boat, I was like, yo, okay, I'm I ain't going. Okay, I'm to the boat when I'm, like, looking down. Right. I was basically like, yo, I ain't going no more than, like, six feet away from this boat. Yeah. Because when I look under and I hear one of y'all go, and then I see blood, I'm going to be able to just go like this, reach, and I'm, I'm on the boat. <laughs> like, I ain't going nowhere. But that's what almost got me. Because, I mean, and the water was really rough. So I'm I'm 
snorkeling, <laughs> which is basically I got the mask on, I'm looking underwater because right. I, I, the whole breathing That's in and out the mouth thing, yes. thing yeah. I, 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 I'm no good at it. I can't do it. Yeah. So I'm on the side of the boat, right? And the waves are kicking up and they're like slamming me back into the boat. So I reach up for the boat, right? And I reach <laughs> up, and as I reach up, my back starts going back, and I feel my foot hit the propeller. Whoa. And I was like, I was like, damn, I'm that far underneath the boat? Like, not hit it where I'm injured. I just felt the propeller. I was like, oh, shit. I was like, man, let me get away from here. And just as I said that, this motherfucking captain yells out, hey, we're going to move. Like turn the boat on. I had moved my foot away from that propeller like literally ten seconds before he turned that motherfucker on, and he gave no warning or nothing. That's he didn't horrible. look around or nothing. He was like, "Hey, we're getting ready to move." <laughs> turn that bitch on. He started like, driving. Oh my god. No, he just turned it on, and then once once the propeller was going and the boat was just sitting neutral, but it was go it was running. He was like, "Hey, oh, everybody, get away from the sides. We're gonna." <laughs> That's what I want to know because you, at this point, you still hanging on to the side of the boat. I was, I was, <laughs> but my feet were under me. I was leaning this way instead of this way, <laughs> and wow. I was like, "This motherfucker could have chopped me the fuck yeah, up." That's real close. He would have chummed the water, <laughs> and you know, I like my seasons. I like hot sauce and stuff. So, like I said, I'm seasoned on the inside already. Mm -hmm. That blood hits the water. Sharks are gonna be like, "That's it." <laughs> Much time. Just, so my just brain because you don't. Bell. Because you don't see us, don't mean we're not here. Exactly. So, you know, um, so I got on the boat and um, I still did the the uh, thing, but I got back on the boat and I waited till my turn to get on the sub. Then I get on the sub, and the wife takes off and she's putting around all over the place, and all all the other white people are putting around. How far down can you go on that sub? It was uh, twelve to fourteen feet. It was on a it was on a cord yeah, or a cable. Yeah. And there was a, a buoy flow. at the top. Is that an airflow cable? No, no, no. What it did was it, it had uh, pumps on the inside right. so that when they put it in the water, you had oxygen already in the right. in trapped. the mass portion. It was trapped. But it also was pump pumping that air out and then pumping more air in from, I don't know. I, maybe there was a tank under the seat or something, but I don't know where it was coming from. Right. So, you know, you got to put around for about 15, 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. My shit ain't working. Like, the wife gets on her and, brrr, and she just takes off. And then everybody's spreading and they're going around. I'm hitting the throttle. I'm like, brrr, and my shit just bobbing up in the water. The water ain't going nowhere. That shit had a weight the limit. fish coming up to me and be like, mm. no, what the fuck is you doing? And then fly, you know, swimming off. Yeah. It could off, but I don't know. So I didn't enjoy it, but, you know, and that was... That was, that was it. That was the last time that I actually... Would you do that again, though? It's a, one of those something rings? Not one of those. Like a new one, though? Not one of those. No. Because it was like a bike. So you, you sat in the seat like a motorcycle. Okay. Like you sit on the seat and you lean forward and then you have your handlebars out in front of you and then the whole mass thing comes it's over. Like it's part bubble. of the seat yeah. and the bubble sits over. So you like steer around and stuff like that. Okay. But everything's out. Just, so the shark be like, oh, okay, I just got to peel my meal before I eat it. So let me just... It's like yeah. a crawfish. Yeah. <laughs> or bite this, bite this cable and just watch them, right. <laughs> watch them flip around. Yeah, listen, I got to so, I gotta, uh, flip it over and make sure it's even on both sides. But um, yeah, so I, I, I love the ocean too, but I don't go deeper than like my shins anymore. I mean, you know, because I've, I've seen... Uh, white tips, black tips, and sandbar sharks, they'll come up to 18 inches of water. Mm -hmm. And they got ragged teeth. They'll bite the shit out of you. Like, I've seen, <laughs> like it's not all great whites. Like, they'll I've come seen up and all, they'll bite. Those, all those sharks to include great whites on TV. <laughs> and that's the only place that I will ever see them. I have never seen a great white outside of the TV. Because one, they can't keep them in aquariums. Because they, they die immediately. Like, they never last in the frame. So, nobody keeps great white. So, you gotta go to South Africa for that shit. Shit me. Hey. Shit you get, me. They, they, they got like the South Africa. They, they, the they, most, they, most shark. Yeah, great because whites. they've been feeding the motherfucking Somalian pirates for the last yeah. 150 years. Awesome. Now, I'm good. I'm good. Did you, hear about the, did you hear about the orcas that was killing the great whites? Yeah. Oh. 
Yeah, off of was, uh, wow. uh, what is it? The cape, coast. cape, uh, where they had the cape first seals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The orcas they, started attack. They started attacking the sharks. Were yeah, mother, yeah. mother nature, bro. And it was cool. <laughs> what was cool about it is they actually, uh, they actually developed that stuff that's called shark off. Because what happens is when the killer whales, they learn, they learn that sharks go into uh, tonic mobility if you flip them over. Yes, they they they, they, they just yeah. yeah they're done. So the killer whales was submarining from underneath the sharks. You tip them, hit them, <laughs> stun them, and while he's stunned, another one come grab his flipper and flip that motherfucker over WWE style, done. and the shark is done. <clears throat> so they just laugh at him for a while, bat him around for a while, then they bite in. Pull his liver out, eat his liver, and then just let the rest so, go. Yeah, they, it was for so I mean, yeah, sharks. Maybe no, 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 because no, no, they were, doing is, it for, they were doing it for sport. Yeah. They wasn't even eating them. Yeah, they were just doing it for fun. Yeah, they was like, Yo, yeah, Mel, we like <laughs> liver, and that's send me the fun. YouTube yeah. video, Mel, if you got it. Yeah. I want to oh, see it. I, I, just, I, I just heard it's, about it's it on the news, but Shark they, Week every yeah. year. Like they'll show yeah. that episode every day. I want, I want to see <laughs> the well one, the shark. Yeah, they were talking. They were talking. They were just talking about it was the great white. Might be in danger because all these great white carcasses was just showing up on beach. Fuck them. Right. That's what I'm saying. And what they do though, but when the so now when the sharks, when the great whites actually see that there's a pod of whales around, they'll release pheromones in the water that once the other sharks sense that pheromone, they take the fuck off. They out of there. Like, and they were worried because during the heaviest time that it was shark season, they're like, there's no great whites here. Like the yep. seals are like, ain't no problem with us, nigga. Yep. <laughs> like, shit. <laughs> nah, but the killer shit. whales eat the seals too. Huh? The killer whales eat seals. Yeah, they do, yeah. but they they're not as quick or maneuverable, so yeah. the seals can get away from them. Yeah. Them damn they're sharks. They're more flexible when they right. go up and down. But the great whites, them motherfuckers go way down deep. Seals can't see them, and then they come flying up and they breach yeah. as they're biting the motherfucking seals. Killer whales don't do that, so the seals. Seals just like, oh, I can see you. I can outswim you any day of the week. But um, yeah, so they once they found out that that pheromone was it, they actually captured that essence and they've tested it. So they go to a tank of like every, almost every type of shark. It could be sandbars, it could be gray sharks, Tiger, tigers, yeah. bull sharks, Hammerhead. whatever. They spray some of that shit in the water. Them motherfuckers all ass. Wow. They're like, we don't want no parts of that. Because it's like liquid fear to sharks. So I'm thinking, why the fuck don't they cover beaches in that shit? Like, yeah. like if you know what does it, School why we still fight? Right. Put yeah, that shit like in your motherfucking lotion. Word. Like when we found out, like when the world found out or thought there was vampires, everybody was walking around with garlic necklaces, nigga. Yeah, <laughs> we, we, have, we, have, we have that. We have something like that in the real world, though. You know what I mean? Why are you looking at me? Because I know you're about uh, to yeah, go yeah, stupid. <laughs> It's coming though. It's called child support, son. <laughs> yeah. Run. <laughs> That's what it's called, man. Yeah. yeah you're about right. Woo! <laughs> you're about right. Pheromone for that so, plan B. Yeah, yep. Some of us are immune to it. Right. No, you got a headache. Two you kids. Plan B versus three like, kids. Final. Four kids. Yeah. Like <laughs> they're immune. Surprise <laughs> ones, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you. One and done, dog. I was out of there. <laughs> All right, ready for the All right. <laughs> What's the rush, Cliff? What's the rush? Uh, yeah, you see that? Now he's doing that shit. <laughs> I ain't say nothing about no time and that shit. Hey, you got that doo doo water to get back to. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> I'm definitely not going back over there. Hell no. I'm about to get some meat. I'm fucking starving. Fuck that shit. Wow. Doo doo water to do it to you. You wasn't here, you wasn't here for that. Oh my god. I'll tell you. Ladies man. and gentlemen. You know what? Nah, I'm a Nah, tell him. I'm about to tell that story. Tell him. Nigga, come the, on, nigga. Come on, nigga. Nah, nah, I'll tell you. Come on, nigga. Come on, man. I'll tell you. Tell him. Tell, 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 tell him. Tell him. Tell him. Or you going to get my version. No, it's going to be. Your version is going to be It's going to be left. I'll tell you after. So, no, man, this is live. He don't want everybody to know. He's right, live. Right. No, so, I don't fucking want to eat, Cliff, nigga. That's why I'm going to go for Cliff the was at, shit. Cliff was at the, he the, he at, the, at, at the girls at the girls' family house, he and he was masturbating in <laughs> no, their toilet. That's the only so story. he was on the toilet masturbating. <laughs> hey, shut up. Don't tell the story. That's not how that fucking story works. The doodle water shot up in his face. That shit. None of that shit happened. They hit him in the eye. None of that shit happened that way. 
God damn. <laughs> <laughs> Another sham sandwich. Jesus. I told you to tell it, dog. <laughs> no, the story's too long. They don't want to get it what you rather fuck. Now I know why he looked like that. It, it would have already been over if you No, it wouldn't have. So, so, so he was in the bathroom masturbating. No, check it out. That was, that's how you know how the story goes. Come on, Clint. God damn it, man. Pause your life. It's okay. And he, 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 he won't he tell. Couldn't, <laughs> he, he, could, he couldn't wipe his face with the... the he couldn't wipe right, the right, right, off his face right, because quick, the so towels were all on the shit. floor. Stop. <laughs> all right, man. Real quick. Okay. All right. I'm I'm talking I'm dropping the kids off on the way over here. That's why I was running behind. Yeah. And the fucking um I'm talking to their mom, my in law or my mother in law run out of the, out of the fucking house gotcha. in the garage and tell me, call my name and say my father in law shrugging to top stop the fucking toilet from whatever. Right. So I'm like So like, her she, husband She's saying it's flooded. Yeah, okay. That's what she says, flooded. So I'm like, flooding, why the fuck is it flooding? <laughs> right. So I run inside. I run it because I'm here and, and I can help him. Because it's okay. Let's tell, let tell, let tell, let tell. So I'm running inside. My kids like pointing me like, Dad, Dad is over here. Go inside. The house is big. So I'm like turning fucking corners left and right like a maze. I finally go to the to the master bedroom. He's in there. And it's I'm looking on the floor. It's like fucking 79 towels on the floor. Oh, it's flooded. My God. <laughs> and as he. And again, as he's fucking trying to clog up the or tie up the, the tube on the bottom of the toilet, yeah, he's taking mad water to the face, to the, to the right side. Of the <laughs> shitty water? It's no shit in the water. Oh. It's clear water. Okay, okay. I know, that's what I'm saying. They make it up because it's not shitty water. It's clear water. Right. But he's still taking water to the face. Yeah. So he's like trying to tell me about. He's trying to tell me that he couldn't get to it. And I know he had he had surgery in his eyes. Taking too long, water to the face. So it was no doo doo in the water. He's taking water to the face. Look like a yacht, a you a you doo and shit. But it ain't, it ain't, I'm sure it ain't clean. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. So either way. So now I'm like, what the fuck? Move over. Let me get to it because you obviously you can't get to it. So now. <laughs> My no, spot. We're taking the do the water today. Now I'm I'm trying to avoid the fucking water. So I'm like this. It's all on my arms. Oh, yeah, get on my sneakers. Where's the water coming from? From the, it's from the bottom of the toilet. Oh, so it's from the bottom of the of the oh. of the bin of okay. the basin. Okay. So I'm just gonna and it's, it's going everywhere. I'm like, what the fuck? So I'm like, yo, just run downstairs and go turn the water off. Like that should have been your first move. Right. So when you finally did, I get to be able to get it on a little bit so it can stay on for a little bit. But it's still loose, uh, loose a little bit outside. He turns it off. What is everywhere? You know what I'm saying? I'm like, what the fuck? And I'm, then she's like, I don't know. He told, I told him to do it with the warranty. I said, you had a warranty? Why the fuck would you try to do this shit? <laughs> well, you he, you paid the duck to the call right. for this shit. See, so what? Um, it's worse when the shit's all over your towel and now everything is right. like three feet. You're taking water to the face. Like, <laughs> you got new water in your, in, your, in your arm and shit. You got wash All this shit was on my sneakers. So I was like, man, I'm running behind. So that's it. I got here. So it's the same story. clothes? You went home same and changed? <laughs> 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 yeah, you went home and changed? No, they had time for that shit. Yo, move the camera over here, son. No, 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 shit. no, 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 let's go. Let's go. You know what I mean? You ain't smell shit. Shut up, oh, man. Oh my god. We don't have another fucking Corona twenty over here. <laughs> oh, there was god. no doodle to goddamn water. Oh, shit. <laughs> and this is the same dude. This is the same dude who loves you the, the 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 bidet in your house and shit, man. Yeah, that was the Super Bowl day. I would yeah. never do this shit though. Forget it. That's like whatever. Cool. Sound like you did it today, nigga. Involuntarily. You took a bidet to the <laughs> face. Involuntarily. <laughs> All right. You fucking with that doodle water, man. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for sharing. Oh, my God. That shit was hilarious, man. Thank you for that. Okay, now we're going to do it. (laughs) Oh, man. Let's think real hard. Ladies and gentlemen, (laughs) it's that time again. Mel, would you rather think real hard, bro? I'm having uh, having some some technical difficulties right now. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it's that time again. It's time for Would You Rather, the segment of the show where I give the fellas some topics and they got to decide which one of the ones they're going to do. They can't say that they're going to die. They can't say they ain't going to do it. Uh, they're allowed to ask questions, but they have to give an answer to which one they would pick. So. And Malcolm can't add extras after he already Oh, yeah, said I can. It. This is my game, oh, though. Come on. So we can I add extras. You can, but you just can't change the scenario. Okay. Like y'all added the, the condoms and the mask last time. So I that mean makes sense. That's not changing the scenario, added. that's protection. Yeah, you added. So I can add two. The fuck up was a fuck a chicken no, with chicken pox with no condom. You say it, 
You can't and you can't come back and say, "Oh no, no." He uh, said he it, closed the loop. Remember the said. rules. Remember the rules, though. If I say well, that, I give you a scenario, and you can ask questions. It okay. doesn't say that you can manipulate your answer. You can only ask questions. So if you're going to ask, I remember that. Part. I'm going to, I just now said it. Just it's now. now. I said it in the early would you rather later. Dude, I say that every <laughs> introduction. I ask the dudes All questions right, and they can ask me questions about it or they can ask me questions and then blah, say blah. So, okay. All right. Good. Here we go. I want to see how well y'all signs <laughs> there. These. All right. Here we go. First one of round two. <laughs> Comedian CJ Trowers. <laughs> Big tone, the heavy duty cutie, and sleep dog way out in SoCal. Would you <laughs> rather make love to Beyonce while Jay Z makes slow, passionate love to oh. you, and die before you orgasm, or have your nuts slowly cut off with a rusty razor blade and fed to you? Y'all need it again. Yeah, I need, I need it again. You definitely changed that, that Beyonce and Jay-Z one. Hey, man. <laughs> you definitely changed that one. That's right. I, I got to close up the time loops. <laughs> Would you rather make love to Beyonce while Jay-Z makes slow, passionate love to you and you die right before you orgasm or have your nuts slowly cut off with a rusty razor blade and then fed to you. <laughs> yeah, loopholes closed. <laughs> nah. All right, what you got over there, Sleep? I'm I'm, ta I'm taking B because I'm team protect the booty. So <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, I'm like I can, I can live without nuts. In the first one, right? The first one, yeah. This, exactly. this feed, feed my nuts. This is yeah, fun. Let's go. I can, I can, I can yeah. live without nuts. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Let's go. Nuts. Yes. It's not just living without nuts. You gotta eat them. Hey, nigga, I'm hey, still gonna hey, live, hey, and I'm not I'm getting my ass live. fucked. And you're gonna live knowing that you ate your own nuts. It's your own. I live, and I, own. I don't. I, I'm it's not talking about nuts. the disgusting part. I'm talking about the emasculated part. Hey, like when you I'll, look down and there's no nuts, and you know that you ate them. Listen. Hey, you asked me to fuck out. Beyonce uh -huh. and never and really enjoy it because I'm getting fucked by uh, him. <laughs> and if I nut, I'm going to die. What the fuck? No. And they all say, Jay-Z got a big one, too. So that's I have not. heard that. That's what yeah. motherfuckers say. Pause. Super ass shit. Pause. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> but shit. Hell no. That's why they call him the camel. <laughs> Yo, just feed me my no. nuts. <laughs> nah. Yeah. No. <laughs> all three sure nuts. Nah. All, all three nuts. <laughs> hey. I'll, I'll I'll eat mine before I eat somebody else's. If I eat mine, guess Facts. what? Facts. Facts. Let's go. It's That's still it. it's so still B. me. Yeah. So, yeah. Go, Let's go. Let, go let, me, let me make note of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna add that part to it now, man. Then he can't get us like, no extra shit. Thank you. But now he's gonna say, "Let me chores and somebody else's too." <laughs> Fuck. There will be two hair nuts next time. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but go, go ahead and scratch that that Beyonce and Jay Z one out. They're out of torment. They've been they've been yeah, eliminated. Take that Beyonce shit off. Oh man, oh, I like that one too. Okay. <laughs> I, like I the wouldn't be able to get it up if I know I it, to... my booze game raped and shit. I, I wouldn't be able to get it up. Man, last oh. week you was taking it in the butt, man. Pause. <laughs> 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 Last wow, week wait, he was wait, taking it in. Compared wait, to what? Wait a minute. Huh? What was the comparison to? Hey, all I know is you said you you take it in the butt. Though. Yeah, but I'm not I'm not sexual. You said this is the money else. maker. I take it in the butt. Yeah. Team protect the booby. Okay. Right. Facts. All right. So we so the group is having their nuts cut off with a rusty razor blade and yep. being fed to them. Yep. Outstanding. Okay. The second one. Second, would you rather? Would you rather have your kids dipped in honey and grubs and tied no. down in front of a grizzly bear's den on the first day of spring until they're eating or every day until you die? No, I'm sorry. Or every day until you die, get anal raped by a rabbit panda with alopecia and scabies. Bye, kids. No saving option for either. You said bye kids. Bye kids. Bye kids. The nigga is gone. 
Jesus Christ. Yeah, no, nah, I'm team protect the booty. <laughs> you had a good run. <laughs> So you gonna watch as your kids are slathered down with honey and, and grubs and then basically fed to a bear on the first day of spring. If I know what option B is, then yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. yes. With binoculars, zoom in, camera. Yeah, no. Nah, team protect the booty. <laughs> the heavy duty cuties pondering. So the CJ mm. trial is over here. I have like calculations and shit. <laughs> like, okay. He's looking for the loopholes. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> this is where I need the uh, Jeopardy music because uh, you okay. guys get All right, so quiet. for me, I'm going with B. He's wearing a condom and I'm spraying him with Lysol. You say spraying with Lysol? Yes. <laughs> 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 he was coming. He was coming. <laughs> That's it. So, so you're back to taking it in the ass. Is that you just said on the last one, I gotta protect the booty. Now you go to <laughs> because it's your kids though. I get if I it's get for it. my, kids, my kids, I will yeah, the rule with it. I will give my life for my kids. Yeah, I get it. Whatever I, it takes. Well, for obviously, because you're gonna give your booty for your kids. It's all right. Yeah. Uh, every every life. Yeah. Not my butt. Every okay. day. My kids come first. Nah, I'm gonna kill myself after that. Every so. day. Nah, you can't do that. You ain't say that. You ain't say that's the rule from the beginning. He did yeah, say that. Yeah. He did oh, say you that. You can't say I'll just die. God damn. <laughs> he did say that. No, <laughs> but I'm going to kill that bear, that that polar bear or whatever it is, panda bear, afterwards. Yeah, here's a bear. Go. He didn't it. say that. He didn't say that. He didn't say that. He didn't say I can't the bear kill the bear. Go. Here's another one. The bear got to go. Will, so, yeah. B. I, will, I will kill the, the bear. Got the bear got to go. Now you sound like you sounded like you sounded like Cliff in the prison. No. You're just gonna do just oh, no, the, you're just gonna go John Wick on the bear. No. Like Niggas, a bear there's just, one bear, not a whole prison. There's one fucking bear gotta get through. He ain't on cocaine. He's one bear. Yep. Because once and he you, busts that nut, he's gonna go night night. Up and kill a bear. <laughs> there you go. And <laughs> you didn't say that I wouldn't be standing there with a samurai sword. Right. So, there you go. <laughs> so be it is. Good one. I tell you what I'm talking about. My nigga. I, you know, I, 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 that's right. Uh -huh. it's, just, it's the kids, man. Uh -huh. I can't. I can't. Yeah, 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 uh -huh. uh -huh. yep. Okay. B. Okay. Go ahead and get the alopecia booty rape up out of here. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. That's what they said they would take. It's two to one. Oh, come on. <laughs> we, got, we got two girls, man. Yeah, we got I got a girl, too. But we got a girl. Have to get her. All of y'all got girls. Oh, yeah. The bear going to have to get her. <laughs> wow. All right. Wow. Okay. So I got two fellas in the room that's going to take it up the booty by a panda bear with alopecia and scabies. You didn't say scabies. No, where did that scabies come from? Oh you said alopecia. Whatever. It. Either way, the nigga gonna See, die. y'all start going crazy. Y'all y'all don't listen to the whole thing. What does the last word say next? Alopecia and what? Yeah, okay. All right. <laughs> he gonna die either way. Yeah. Fine. Put on phonics over here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And number three. Okay. Oh, <laughs> This is Cliff's favorite right here. Nah, Mike, Mike Tyson. Tyson. <laughs> Mike Tyson. <laughs> it can't be that. Hey, it's already he's Mike no, he's, he was out of it. Yeah, Mike, out of yeah Mike's out of here. Yeah, it's either Mike Tyson Mike. or Michael J. Fox. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, yeah, I didn't bring Mike back yet. Oh, he's, he's, he's going to make it, though. Okay. Would you rather spend the rest of your life with a stoma and a speaker box that shoots oh. sperm down your throat yeah, every oh, that third word? Yeah, you you were into that. <laughs> I wasn't into it, nigga. That was the fucking better option. <laughs> fuck you. Yeah, you right. Tomorrow was into that. What nah, the fuck that was the best nigga, option, so that. That. Whatever. Yeah. yeah. Every third word, <laughs> even in your dreams. <laughs> <laughs> Talking and they shut up, nigga. What's the what's the fucking next thing? <laughs> oh, you know God. the next one's about to be some booty rape shit. Right. Yeah. <laughs> All right, would you rather, would you rather spend, spend the rest of your life with a stoma and a speaker box that shoots sperm down your throat every third word, or gargle fresh minty Catholic priest semen every morning? Oh my God. So either you go to spit or swallow. Which one you go? To? <laughs> oh my God! Okay, <laughs> Woo. Did you say minty? Minty. How fresh minty. minty. 
I don't know. You the one swallowing because it, dog. It's holy. You don't want to gargle it. I don't. You told me it was fresh and minty. <laughs> so, <laughs> say the second one again. Uh, or gargle fresh minty Catholic priest semen every morning. All right, look, fellas, we got to come together. We got to get one of these motherfuckers out <laughs> no, you answer your own. <laughs> Get out of here, man. Cheating shit. I'm about to text you, man. We got to get one of them nasty motherfuckers out of here. <laughs> exactly. For good. Exactly. So we need to all come to a degree. Right. <laughs> all right. We're going to start doing it on the count of three. You pick one. Y'all start doing that shit. Hey, I, I have a question. On the, on the first one, Who's uh whose semen is going down the throat? Is it your own? Ooh, good question. Uh, anyone that you desire. Huh? Whatever, whatever. Who, who the fuck says I want I to pick Ooh, semen out? Bro, I got I got this. <laughs> okay, hold on. You ask your question, so somebody else gotta answer. <laughs> don't, don't be giving them the clues. I see where you're going. I see where you're going. <laughs> <laughs> Two. We gotta get two up out of here, right? <laughs> because two is someone else's season. Immediately makes you gay. <laughs> no, it don't, son. It's holy, bruh. It's just somebody else's season that makes you gay. It comes with the Holy Spirit. <laughs> no, he said no, no, it's number one is the one that you asked about. Yeah, number one is the one. Yes, number number one is the one. Yes. one, is the one, is the one hey, Antio, we stop it. Pick one. <laughs> So he's saying pick one. He said swallow. No. Yeah. I'm saying pick two. Get two out of here. Okay. We don't better we don't better experience two. Let me ask a question. The first the the first one is I see you. The first one. Hold on, hold on. So the first one is every third word no matter what for life. Yep. The second one, you're swallowing us. Uh, you're not swallowing. You're just gargling it. Gargling. Gargling. right back out. Just Wait. once a day. Yeah. Every day. Not once. I know. One time. Once you, a, yeah. you said once a day. Yeah. Right. Versus. Makes sense. All right. So then I'm going to go to because based on the analogy, it's not every third. It's not a continuous thing. It's a one, yeah. one shot give. Boom. All right. Two. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. no. Saying, Hold up. No, no. He's saying with the priest is once a day. Right. Not the stoma. I know what, I'm, I, I, what I just said. Okay. Every yeah. third word. That's okay. So yeah. the priest should Priest. Is. Okay, Please. so then every day when you wake up, yes, Monday, yes, me, yes, Monday, yes, bro, yes, 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 right out and you love it. Uh, and we right Wednesday, Wednesday, boom, three seconds, back, out of here, boom, boom. No, no, no more fucking storm. That's it. We're, we're done with that one. Kill it. That's it. Out of here. Yep. Question, <laughs> question. When you guys drink anything, yep. water, beer, milk, anything, when you spit it out, do you ever get it all out? Yep. Yep. Come on. Let's hey, be real. No, no. He's trying to have a shit in your mind. I'm just asking. It don't Let's matter. Be real. You're talking no. about a stone so, every three so words. Basically, right. not every three you're seconds. Gonna turn, you're going to turn your throat to a daycare center. Whatever. What? It's every daycare center. Every day. 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 Stoma. Exactly. The stoma, at least it never touches no. your tongue. It just goes straight The stoma straight is an EBT card. That shit's an EBT card. You swipe it. I don't want to hide a, a semen look, IV. Y'all missed it. Fuck? Like Sleep was saying, uh, it doesn't have to be somebody else's. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I don't want that shit every, every third word. Every third word? Nope. It could be your own. I don't care. I'm gargling and getting out in three seconds. It's not in here. A no. different Catholic. Once a day. A Catholic priest is nuts. Yes. Of going in your mouth versus your own yes. fluids just going down your Every throat that you never words. touched. Yep. It's your own. It don't matter. It's like words. It's continuously non It's 24 hours in a day. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot of times. And you're going to be fucking talking in your sleep. But you won't taste it. What? You won't. And then it comes it's coming just down come off the hole. hole. It don't matter. It's going from here straight down. Oh, Every third word. on my it's stomach, nigga. That's too much. <laughs> that shit makes me stop. But it's acid. yours. But what if he coughs? Then that shit's like. <coughs> <laughs> 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 
<laughs> that shit is like a fucking sucker sucker, man. Oh, I don't Hell know. No. That shit is like a shotgun. I didn't thought about the car. Hey. <laughs> Hey, we we need to get we need to get the worst one up out of here. Yeah, the worst one's the stoma. Wait, we keeping the priest. Let's go. The stoma's out. Done. So the stoma is worse than the, yeah. the priest. Yep, yeah. because it's every third word. It's all day, every day. Oh, y'all ain't gonna like the next round. Okay. I'm just uh, telling you, that. you ain't gonna like the next round. Woo, I guarantee got, you. We got to that y'all, one. Y'all gonna right. pick. Yeah. Yeah. We got to that one, sir. Hey. Good job, Mel. Hey, <laughs> team teamwork. Right. Teamwork <laughs> makes the dream work. Right. <laughs> hey. We're going we gonna to have you thinking from, from here on out. Make sure you get my cell phone uh, number later, brother. Yeah, just to recap. So, yeah, we got the, uh, what do we got? We got uh, Mike Tyson. Nuts slowly getting don't, cut don't, off don't, and don't fed to you. About that. You're getting, uh, it was a, a tie, or it was a two to one split on Panda Bear. Panda Bear. Yeah. So, right. either one of those could come back. Thank you. What are you talking about? What do you mean? It's, it's two, two to one. one. Yeah, it's two to one. Uh, no. Penny ain't here. Oh, that's um, some bullshit. You can't uh, <laughs> oh, oh, Okay, guys, I'm on your side. No, you're not. No, you're you not. However, no, you're not, not son. The you keep fucking moving the goal, the goal the, line. The committee the fuck out hey, stated that. I know when, I, I know know when I'm getting Charlie are. Brown. I know when I'm getting Charlie Brown. You keep snatching that football from the front of me. I know when I'm getting Charlie Brown. Wah, 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 wah. Get the fuck out of here. Try to you know snatch your liberty on us. How do you have a standing fucking vote that doesn't exist? No, hell no. Mm -hmm. It's two to one, bro. Hey, man. I'm offended. The committee does exist. No, no, no. I, I, you, I, you, you, I, I identify you as a committee. Fuck your feelings. Fuck that. Bullshit. Oh my god. Okay. So. And then the final we got, you guys are gonna goggle fresh minty, uh, Catholic priest, mm -hmm. semen every morning. Yep. Yeah. Yep. So those are the three that, well, those are the four that move on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. He, he looks. Enough. He looks so disappointed. Right. He's so disappointed. Because he's no. now, son. His mind. No, no, they didn't even hear that, did they? Yeah. I heard four too, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yesterday, yesterday, go fly. It was three. I heard and four. Three. Three. <laughs> no, it's three. Okay. Okay. I said those are the four to move on. Y'all said yeah. No, uh -huh. no. Uh -huh. he's three. disappointed. All right. <laughs> three, no, no four to go on. Move three. It gotta be four. No. Why? No. Because it was a split decision. No, no. no. Then, no. Then who majority are you saying? Are you saying, well, are you saying, are you saying sleep is wrong or you guys are wrong? Who's I'm wrong? saying the majority the is two to the one. The majority is two to one. There we go. Actually, Three. I vote with sleep. You never so vote any other time. You fuck. <laughs> then you gotta get into would you rather? Once again, you, 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 you gotta answer. Once again, you gotta answer all. Whenever there's a two to one, the committee what states. What the fuck did that? that <laughs> I this shit. I need these bylaws, nigga, on paper. I want this hey. shit forged in the stone like the commandments, nigga. And so I, I can never be changed. I identify myself as being on the committee. <laughs> <laughs> That's some bullshit. That's, <laughs> That's right. <laughs> I just identify as the chairman of the board, nigga. This is bullshit. I want to see that shit notarized. Clear, I get your stamp. I'm about to get my stamp out the car, nigga. Hey, all, all these callbacks. You guys, you guys are good. You guys are good. All, the, all these callbacks. You guys are fine now. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all are fine. Oh, oh, that was good. Keep changing up the game. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, that's officially going to conclude what yes. you rather for this week. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You know, comment on on what you would do in the Would You Rather's or who's wrong. If you don't want to put what you would do, just comment on who's wrong. And um, if one of these guys are wrong, I will take your decision, or the committee will take your decision in high regard. And we might have to overturn. You know that the, the committee, dog. It's we're gonna get lost. My hands are tied. What's the address of the committee? <laughs> <laughs> right here. Right. Right there. <laughs> there go see these niggas. Me too. Right. <laughs> the committee's right there, dude. Get naked unless you just oh, visit it. Don't make it no. weird. <laughs> that's 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 rule one in the committee. <laughs> you and this fucking bear in the corner of the committee. Like, yeah. <laughs> hey, you notice there've been a lot of bear, you know, uh, questions right. for some reason. Right. So it's some kind of bear. Right. Discrimination, bro. Hello. Discrimination. 
us would other you animals, rather I make other it about animals that want to get in the fucking mix? Ooh, they want to be included. Like who? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> give, give, give me some. No, I'll, I'll add them. No, no. I can squirrels. easily add them. No, squirrels. Small animals like no, squirrels. You... Oh, okay. So but next I, week will be. Uh, would you rather in some s- squirrel semen? Okay, no, that's not, that wasn't part of the oh, original I, thing. We still, when I, when in, the, in, in the, whatever's already been said, <laughs> yeah, we're in the, in the, the brackets. Yeah. So that's gonna save so, for next season. As you can see, I, I keep it all down, so you know. Yeah, just, okay, well, know. yeah, that's not. So no, next season, anything. we'll just yeah. yo. It See, squirrels any, anywhere. Any, you want to, and it, squirrels got two sets of nuts. So I, I mean, mean like if we really, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, it's okay. So you have no problem just drinking squirrel nut. I'm, can I comment on that? Because that's, <laughs> that is season two. Right. He did say it's only this thing. Hey. It's only that much. Hey, hey, like, like and subscribe. Season Watch season two. <laughs> this motherfucker going to do something. Like, nigga on steroids. Some crazy stupid Oh, like man. That. Yeah, right. next season. I got some doozies, too, man. Prison yeah, yeah, I squirrels really thought steroids. about steroids. <laughs> <laughs> The first openly squirrel gay prison. For all they eat is steroids. No, no, no. That's a my nuts, son. That's right. a my nuts. They they eat physical human nuts instead of like walnuts and, and tree nuts. So cool, guys. <sighs> all right, so oh, that was great, guys. That was great. Mm-hmm. Anybody else got anything this week? None. Y'all got a second? Of course, because I have a rebuttal. Against the fight story last Sorry. week. <laughs> no, I think I got a memo. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I got. There, there was a small part, part that was left, but go ahead, and sleep. Go ahead. So, first of all, the bike that I had was a, huff, a Huffy Racing Fifty. Top of the line. That's what it was. The Racing Fifty. The, Huff, the Huffy Racing Fifty. Now, with hold on, give a little with, background for for uh, new tuners. So, yeah. uh, last week I told the story about uh, me and my brother in a bike situation. So. You that's all jealous. I'm gonna give you. You were jealous. Well, that's all I'm gonna give you. If you want more, or you want the watch full the story, watch last week's yeah, episode. What type episode. of man are you? All right. So, so real quick, he, it was it was stated last week that um, he didn't he didn't understand or he didn't remember why he jumped on my front tire. Well, the reason why he jumped on my front tire is right before he jumped on my front tire. I held his bike, which was held in high regard than in the projects that we lived in, over my head and threw it as far as I could. I completely forgot so about that. I disrespected. I, there was there was a, there was a ton of disrespect before he jumped on. He jumped on my bike. Now, mm-hmm. the, yeah, the he made the you part, sound like a sucker. Yeah, yeah, no. Mm-hmm. He left. He left that part out. Yeah, there was. That part there was definitely. I didn't, I didn't leave was, it out intention. I completely <laughs> forgot. Because I even said was, in the story, I was like, I don't remember what it was, yeah. but he did something, and I, yeah, and everybody was laughing. It was a reaction. Because I said everybody was laughing, like, ah, oh, ha, ha, and I was like, all right, bet. And, yeah, so I just forgot so, what it was. So then um, we, li- we lived in uh, we lived in the low rises of the, of the homes, and all the homes outside the front of the homes had these, these big concrete flower pots. And he was standing on the flower pot, and he jumped off the flower pot, on and landed on and it was it was actually the back wheel and yeah. it was the back wheel of my bike and they turned it into a straight like l like <laughs> if you were looking at it the wheel looked like an l like the letter l was malcolm a big dude at that age yes yeah. malcolm's okay. been six four since he was like five. was he <laughs> heavy, <laughs> was he heavy yes, or muscular? He malcolm malcolm is always he's always been big he was always the kid that like he was he was the first pick with everything because mm. he's he was always bigger than the rest of the kids in the neighborhood Damn, son. Except for Shelly. I don't know yeah, what yeah, Shelly was a beast. Shelly was a beast. a female. Whose girl was huge. But it, but it, it was funny. Malcolm was big, but he didn't... I don't think he knew he was big. But I was the smallest kid, but I thought I was the biggest kid. Yeah. So I was always the one running my mouth. Marsha, you know, Marsha, pop, Marsha. Pop, popping off, ready to fight. And, you know, that. But, yeah, no. Nah, there was definitely... That, that, that particular situation, there was definitely a... Uh, there was a fuse that I lit. And... He exploded on the back tire of my bike. Now the rest of it is kind of true. I knew that the, bike, the, the back. I, I knew that the tire was wobbly, but again, like we was talking about earlier, I've Malcolm's always been big. I've always been fast. So even at that early age, I knew I was fast. <laughs> so as far as the whole, 
they, it made they, they made me think that my bike was faster because the tire was wobbling. They said that, but I knew that the tire was wobbling. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. <laughs> you you, you thought your you bike was ride faster, a bike. dog. You can't <laughs> ride a bike. Do you know what? I, what I will say is that the dude who fixed the bike, he also according according to the ghetto kids, he he had the he was the fastest bike rider in the neighborhood. Yeah, so, without a, but, without a question. So what he would do is he would take his handlebars and he would push them all the way forward. So like it would be like a regular bike. Yeah, it'd be like a regular bike, but it would, he would, it would he would lean forward like it was a ten speed. So he too had a Huffy Racing Fifty. So when I got mine, I thought that I was just like him. So I he he took my handlebars and cocked them forward, and that's what I thought made my bike faster than everybody else. Not the wobbly tire. I did the exact same thing. Rebuttal. Well, rebuttal falsified you don't remember going straight down wayne street down our block with me gene thomas donnell elliot everybody behind you while you were what winning the race all the way down to the end of the block where the wild was you don't remember that yeah that, had, that, not, that was not way not, after the handlebars not, beat. no because he because once because <laughs> that, that was another thing that thomas did he, he pushed the handlebars forward to try to hide the fact that the back tire was wide <laughs> he was like, see, this to make you go fast. As soon as I got on, you can't ride a bike. I hear one Latino name, bro. Oh, uh, Billy. Who was homeboy? There's Billy. no damn Latino name named yeah. Billy. Yeah, Billy Ventro. Billy, Billy Ventro. Yeah, uh, he's, he's he's basket. His I think his mom yeah, 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 yeah. Billy couldn't be his, his name. actually his dad's well, name his was pops is, He was yeah, pops, his, his, his pops is black, but his mom is Puerto Rican. Okay. Yeah, I guess his family was Vasquez, but okay, Vasquez, yeah. We got a story about little Billy too, but uh, oh my god, <laughs> I, yeah, we, we, for another day, right? Project Living. <sighs> All right, so that that concludes the rebuttal. So yeah, that was parts I I forgot, and you know, sleep clean those up. So I want to know you ain't just gonna jump on my bike and that's gonna be the end of it. Nah, <laughs> there was some shit that led up to that. <laughs> yeah, I forgot he threw my bike, and yeah, that was that was Hulk, the beginning of Hulk Smash, dude. It was over from there. All right. So again, anybody else got anything for the week? Nope. Nah, my brother. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get ready to get up out of here. Um, it's been a fun show, fun week. Um, check us out next week uh, when we have more topics and we bring out more stuff. I am King Bear in the building. Comedian CJ Trowers. Big Tone, Heavy Duty Cutie. Big Sleep from the West Coast. And we're going to see you next week. Peace. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.